Since the start of the year, Tesla has enjoyed strong performance. Therefore, it is reasonable to assume that purchasing any Tesla stock at this time may be a wise move. Indeed, figuring out the ideal time to invest in the stock market can be challenging. Yet having the appropriate knowledge may provide you a significant advantage in making even better judgments. Thus, if you're considering buying Tesla stock, this is a video you shouldn't miss. Chicken Genius, a stock investor, explains why this could be the ideal time to invest in the stock market. Hi everyone and welcome back to Tesla 2. Days after Silicon Valley Bank failed, the Federal Reserve recently unveiled a new emergency loan program to strengthen the banking industry. According to this program, banks will be able to accommodate the needs of all of their depositors. In addition to Silicon Valley Bank, numerous other banks also own bonds that have lost value as a result of the Fed's fast interest rate increases. In an effort to discourage spending, the Fed has raised interest rates, which may help to contain inflation in the cost of goods and services but doing so also tightened credit standards, making it more difficult for financial institutions to raise capital. Luckily, American financial services company JP Morgan estimated the total amount to be used at about $2 trillion after the U.S. Federal Reserve announced this new emergency loan program. In response to the ongoing liquidity crisis, the Fed emergency loan program may inject up to $2 trillion into the U.S. banking system, according to a statement made by J.P. Morgan. As a result, famed YouTuber and stock investor Ken Tang, often known as Chicken Genius, tweeted that this would be a good time for investors to buy. Why was this uttered by Chicken Genius? What does this signify for the stock of Tesla, then? Let's investigate. But first, please click the like button if you enjoy this kind of stuff. To be informed about everything Tesla related, turn on notifications and subscribe to our channel. The Federal Reserve has consistently declared its commitment to bringing inflation rates down as much as possible. The stock market and financial institutions, however, have been severely impacted by a combination of the Fed's increasing interest rates and a prolonged rise in the inflation rate. The federal funds rate is the interest rate that affects the stock market, and when the Fed raises it, less money is available for purchases. This causes businesses to incur higher borrowing costs, which inevitably has an impact on the stock market. Because of this, stock market investors like Kathy Wood believe that the Fed's ongoing increase in interest rates may not be the best course of action. According to JP Morgan's statement, the $2 trillion fund that the Fed issued was based on the amount of bonds that U.S. banks outside of the top five banks held. While still being bearish, Chicken Genius stated in a tweet that he believes Silicon Valley Bank's failure won't lead to the failure of other banks. In addition to being good news for financial institutions, this could also be good news for the stock market. And presumably soon, the Federal Reserve will begin to lower the federal funds rate in order to boost financial activity. An interest rate decrease has the opposite impact of an interest rate increase by spurring growth, which results in higher profits and a healthy economy. The stock market is something that Chicken Genius is really passionate about, but Tesla is not something he is as passionate about. He even once forecast that Tesla's stock price will drop to as low as $60 in the near future. He claims that Elon Musk's comments on Twitter about prioritizing car sales over margins, which could have an impact on Tesla's profitability and probably result in demand destruction, are to blame. Musk said he wants Tesla to sell every vehicle it produces, and that the only way to do this might be to lower the cost of the company's vehicles, according to Chicken Genius. The well-known YouTuber claimed that Tesla is in the cycle's most risky stage because earnings have not yet been factored in. Tesla has been the subject of a number of comments from Chicken Genius. In one of his videos, he talked about how the future demand for Tesla could be significantly impacted by an economic crisis. He asserts that the auto industry is among the first to be impacted by economic hardships because many individuals may decide against purchasing vehicles because they cannot afford the luxury. Discuss electric vehicles more. Last year, the stock investor stated that he thought Tesla was experiencing major demand destruction, particularly in its Chinese market. According to the shorter wait times for the car, he continued, the Tesla backlog in this area is decreasing. 
In China, Tesla has also slashed delivery times to as short as one week. Model 3 wait periods in the US were likewise rather short, compared to much larger wait times in Europe. According to Chicken Genius, inflation will have a significant impact on Tesla and may cause them to lower car pricing, which would destroy demand in July. According to the stock trader, Tesla will see a decline in delivery during the second quarter of the year. According to him, the impact of inflation will probably result in a slowdown in car manufacturing and delivery. And in fact, this took place. Tesla stated that the increased prices of raw materials, commodities, and logistics, as well as the protracted suspension of the company's Shanghai plants, owing to pandemic-related restrictions, had a detrimental impact on its profitability. Tesla only sold 89,000 cars in China during the second quarter of 2022, as production facilities in and around Shanghai were briefly shut down due to severe shutdown regulations. Tesla's quarterly global sales increased by 27% year-over-year to over 254,000 units, yet they fell short of analysts' projections, in some strange way proving that Chicken Genius's prognosis may have been accurate. But before drawing any conclusions, let's think about something else. Unlike what Chicken Genius thinks, the demand for Tesla won't be negatively impacted by cheaper EVs. It will, if anything, greatly increase it. This is demonstrated by the most recent price reduction that Tesla had in January following price reductions for several of its vehicles in China and the US. According to reports, Tesla received almost 30,000 orders for its EVs in the first three days following the announcement of this price reduction. Once the price decrease was revealed, Tesla reportedly experienced a huge increase in customer traffic at its stores and a flood of new orders. Despite local sales declining by more than 40% year-over-year in December, a Tesla executive revealed that the business delivered more than 10,000 vehicles in China on the first day of the price cut. This is a very strong indication that Tesla's demand will remain robust despite price reductions. Not to mention that, just like Chicken Genius, Tesla was impacted by inflation, predicted the prior year. This quarter saw a huge increase in output for the manufacturer. In the second quarter of 2022, Tesla reported adjusted earnings of $2.27 per share on $16.93 billion in revenue. Moreover, adjusted earnings per share, or EPS, increased 56.6% from the same quarter the previous year, easily beating projections. And revenue increased 41.6% year-over-year, matching analyst predictions. Although it is true that price reductions may have an impact on Tesla's profit margin, it is important to remember that these margins are high and Tesla has a significant competitive advantage in terms of price control allowing it to continue to generate significant revenue, even when its car prices are reduced. Tesla's pricing reductions, according to Wedbush analyst Dan Ives, will increase demand by 12 to 14 percent globally in 2023. According to Garrett Nelson, a stock investor, Tesla will see a smaller profit margin following the price reduction but will still sell more vehicles. While the manufacturer strives to keep up with demand in the largest auto markets in the world, Tesla's EV market has expanded. There is no denying that Tesla has a global footprint now, which it lacked a few years ago. In this EV arms race, it also has the margin flexibility to make bold decisions like price reductions in order to acquire more market share. Do you believe that this is the ideal time to buy Tesla stock? If you're interested in learning more about what Tesla has been up to recently, let us know in the comments box and click on the next video that appears on your screen. You can expect us there.